That's right, Carolyn. And the self-defense experts that we talked with said that when that woman pressed her horn, that was the best thing she could do in her situation since her car was moving. They say you have 10 seconds to get the upper hand on your attacker. In a self-defense situation, the one thing is not to panic. Which is easy to say. That's why Master Eugene Woods, along with Master George Reynolds, showed me some simple moves that can save your life. I'll grab you this this way. Master Woods is the head instructor at the Detroit Martial Arts Institute. Grab my thumb. First, he showed how to escape if you're in your car and someone hiding in the I back seat wrist. grabs you. Grab the thumb. Help him. Help him. Good. That gives you a chance to get out of the car and get away from it. The next move shows how to react to a purse snatcher. If you have a purse on your arm and you're walking away, and I grab your purse, okay, now bring this hand up in the air, open, open, and just turn, turn all the way around, and do this. And if you can, jab the stranger in the nose, chin or eyes, just think stun so you can run. If attacked from behind... When I grab her like this, see, that hurts. <clears throat> that guy's gonna let go. And if attacked from the front, the circle and get away move is one of the easiest and best you can do. All you're doing is circle. Good. Now, if he grabs both arms, make two circles. Oh, you can go this way. Yeah, make two circles. Make two circles and get away. In the end, Master Wood says to give up your car, purse, or wallet. All can be replaced, but you can't. And we all generally have keys on us, so our experts also tell us use it as a weapon and go like this across your attacker's face, and that can help you get away and run. For now, we're live in Farmington Hills. Julie Bonovich, Channel 7, Action News. All right, Julie, very good, valuable information. Thank you for that tonight.